My Hero Academia is jam-packed with quality characters, but, as a matter of public opinion, who are the show's definitive best characters? The cast of My Hero Academia is undoubtedly one of the anime's strongest points. The relationship between the characters and their wild dynamics is an aspect fans never get tired of. The show, at first glance, seems as if it's strayed away from one of the most popular shonen tropes, the power of friendship. But, upon closer examination, the aforementioned friendship power is there all along. It's just implemented in a different form. Because My Hero Academia heavily relies on its characters to tell its story, there's plenty of characters who particularly stick out. The more screen time a character gets, the more likely they'll be favored by the community. And this applies to almost every character since so many of them are fantastic. Many users on my anime list have already spoken up about who their personal favorites are. My Hero Academia boasts a huge cast of characters for its continuing story. The anime is highly recommended on my anime list, with the first season sporting an 8.03 rating based on over 1.5 million users' opinions. Since the anime and manga are still in progress, there's bound to be some changes in the character landscape. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. In today's video, we are going over 15 fan favorite characters according to my anime list. Let's jump into it. Number 15, Fumikage Tokoyami. With his stylish and mysterious quirk, Dark Shadow, it's no surprise that Tokoyami made it as a fan favorite. He's a serious-minded class 1 a student at UA Academy who's usually in the background, but has had his fair share of the limelight in some of the series arcs. Notably, Tokoyami's quirk has a mind of its own and it becomes more powerful and difficult to control in the darkness. Accordingly, Dark Shadow is easier to control and less powerful if there's too much light. Number 14, Tamura Shigaraki. Shigaraki is one of the few villains to get widespread fan support. Shigaraki is a key villain in this series and represents the will of all for one, and he is hell-bent on destroying society. His quirk, Decay, allows him to disintegrate anything that makes full contact with his hands, a truly terrible terrifying quirk for a villain to possess. On top of that, Shigaraki's physical appearance is rather unsettling, as he ordinarily wears the hands of deceased family members as part of his villain getup. Fans might be so fond of him purely because he's such a great villain. Number 13, Keigo Takami. Keigo Takami is the number two pro hero, nicknamed as Hawks. Keigo Takami's codename is the wing hero Hawks, due to his quirk, fierce wings. As the name implies, Takami has a pair of large, red wings on his back that he can use to fly. He makes his debut in the fourth season of the anime as a supporting character. Notably, Takami is the number two pro hero, which may be why fans have taken such a shine to him. He's a highly intelligent character, both mentally and strategically, and he uses this to his advantage when manipulating his quirk. Number 12, Denki Kaminari. Denki Kaminari is a lovable comedy relief character. Kaminari has managed to attract quite the following on my anime list, and it's not hard to see why. Not only is he a friendly, social, and energetic character, but he's also a comedy relief character. Outside of being generally goofy, Kaminari experiences a comical side effect after using his quirk, electrification. If he's not careful, Kaminari can exceed the safe wattage limit for his quirk, leaving him in a vulnerable and airheaded state for up to one hour. He doesn't have great control of his quirk, so this happens quite often. Number 11, Dabby. Dabby became the surrogate for Hero Killer Stain's philosophy. It's difficult to discuss Dabby without spoiling too much of the story, but suffice it to say that he is a character that had a massive fall from grace, which may be a factor in why he's one of the few villains to gather so much fan support. Dabby's entrance into the series happens right after the defeat of hero killer Stain, and he deeply believes in Stain's mission to destroy false heroes. Overall, Dabby is a broken man bent on getting vengeance for the unfairness of his youth, a typical villainous refrain. Number 10, Mirio Thagatha. Mirio Thagatha quickly garnered thousands of fans. Despite being introduced somewhat late to the series, Mirio garnered a surprising amount of support from fans. At the same time, however, it had also be rather puzzling if he didn't make it as a fan favorite. A character of such depth is a valuable asset for any anime, even in a gold mine such as My Hero Academia. Hopefully he'll manage to recover his quirk sooner rather than later. Fans will be disappointed otherwise and rightfully so notably Mirio was one of the original candidates to inherit one for all from All Might before Deku came along. Number 9, Himiko Thoga. She is a beloved villain in the franchise. Himiko is, of course, everyone's favorite bad girl. She might have a few screws loose in the head, but that apparently doesn't stop her from winning fans' love. From the moment she debuted up to now, Himiko never failed to deliver with her over-the-top personality and villainous nature. She's notably one of the few villains in the show who has garnered such overwhelming support from fans. Nevertheless, Himiko's personality is rather unhinged, and she's got questionable perceptions of love and friendship. Number 8, Suyu Asui. She is a consistently rational voice amongst UA students. Very few students at UA Academy could be considered as well-balanced as Suyu. If they don't have self-esteem issues, then they have some serious anger management issues. Indeed, almost every UA student has some sort of characteristic that dominates their personality. However, Suyu, or Tsu Chan as she prefers to be called, is one of the few with a rational attitude towards every situation she finds herself in. She can be overly blunt, but that just adds to her charm. Number 7, Ijiru Kirishima. Kirishima is a surprisingly popular supporting character. Although Kirishima stood out from day one of the series, he never properly showcased his brilliance until the Shai Hasekai arc. That's one thing fans love about My Hero Academia. Almost any character who receives the screen time they deserve will shine. Currently, Kirishima could be considered as a core figure in Class 1A. His fame is even higher than that of Momo Yao Yurazu. Kirishima has a very strong sense of what he considers manly, and strives to live to that code. Number 6, Ochako Yuraraka. Yuraraka is one of the sweetest girls in Class 1A. Ochako might as well be the most prominent female character in My Hero Academia. She's had a front 
front row seat in almost every event relevant to the overall story. It can even be argued that, besides the big three of Class 1A, Ochako is the class's shiniest star. Moreover, as Deku's potential love interest, Ochako certainly deserves all the attention she gets, and more. Ochako's quirk notably utilizes gravity powers, a relatively rare power type in fiction, mostly due to its potential to be overpowered. Number 5. Shota Aizawa Aizawa's cool factor won him many fan votes. If a character looks as cool as Aizawa, has a cool hero name, eraser head, like Aizawa, and has an overall low-intensity personality like Aizawa, then they are very much destined to stand out. Having said so, it's unfortunate that Aizawa often gets underrated by the community, despite him proving his capabilities multiple times. Fans almost take his talents for granted and proceed to set the expectation bar higher and higher. Nevertheless, Aizawa has cemented his place as a fan favorite character. Number 4. All Might All Might is popular, but not as popular as some think he should be. All Might has always been a sensation within the fandom, even prior to officially debuting. His quirky and unique character design easily makes him one of anime's most iconic figures. He is just that brilliant. With that being said, All Might's current status is awkward, to say the least. Many fans think it's rather humiliating for a legend such as himself to be but a sideline character. Regardless, All Might manages to maintain his place within the top 5 fan favorite My Hero Academia characters on my anime list. Number 3. Katsuki Bakugo Bakugo ranks surprisingly high as a fan favorite character. As angry as he is, it's undoubtable that Bakugo won the hearts of the fanbase through his delinquent behavior. It's only natural for him to be in the spotlight, considering that he is Deku's primary rival. Currently, the state of his rivalry with Deku is rather fuzzy. We have no idea who would prevail if it came to another confrontation but suffice it to say that these two childhood friends fuel each other to become the best heroes they can be. Number 2. Izuku Midhoriya Midhoriya is a refreshing change from the typical shonen protagonist. Izuku Deku Midhoriya is the main protagonist of My Hero Academia, and the man aiming to be number one pro hero. As a shonen protagonist, Deku's character build is very much different from his counterparts. While other shonen protagonists tend to go bold and loud, Deku is on the calmer and smarter part of the spectrum. This is due to his original state of being quirkless. Deku had to learn to work smarter and harder than his quirk-blessed peers. Deku's level-headed approach to danger is a rarity amongst shonen protagonists. It is evident, but before we reveal the hero in the top spot, take a guess and type your answer in the comment. Done. Thank you. Number 1. Shoto Todoroki Shoto Todoroki effectively stole the show from its main protagonist. Todoroki is like the Sasuke of My Hero Academia. If Sasuke was a non-edgy teenager who received overwhelming support from the entirety of the fandom, Shoto pretty much dominated the spotlight from the moment he was introduced. Moreover, with regards to character development, Shoto beats the competition, namely Deku and Bakugo by a large margin. Todoroki's current state is nearly incomparable to his personality. At the beginning of the series, his character growth is a huge factor in fans' appreciation for him. This is it for now. Tell us about your favorite character in the comments. See you in the next video, weebs. Till then. Go, baby!